Hello, and welcome to episode 14, A Murder on Col at Colney Island. Inspector Kelly and Professor Fortney were seated in the former's office when policeman Fanning and his charge entered. After Fanning's hurried explanation, Jasper told his story. I'm the ticket taker on a merry-go-round at Coney Island. This being Saturday, we had a big crowd. The trip was almost over when I reached out saying, ticket please, and I see this woman sitting up in the middle of the chariot with that terrible look on her face. She didn't answer, and when I shook her, she slumped over in the corner. I screamed, jumped off, and ran for the manager. I got blood on my hands when I shook her. Yes, sir, she ridden a couple of times, and I have seen the man she was with on the two rides before, continued Jasper, giving a detailed description of him. I happened to see him jump off just before I got to her. The doctor said she'd been stabbed through the heart and had died instantly, queried Professor Fortman. That's right, sir, replied the policeman. It seems strange, Jasper, remarked the professor, that you can give such a good description of this woman's companion on two previous rides when you just happen to notice him jump off. Does the merry-go-round ever make you dizzy? No, sir, I'm used to it. Well, Inspector, said Fortney, turning to his friend, I suppose you're going to hold this man. Certainly, replied Kelly. That's just about the dizziest story I have heard in a long time. <gasps> what testified the police holding Jasper? Jasper said he found the woman sitting up in the middle of the chariot. The motion of the merry-go-round would have made it impossible for a dead body to remain upright in the middle of the chariot. Oh, very good.